All right, video tour. You guys want to know what it looks like? They haven't been up here. This is the road coming up to my place. I was just down below me a little bit. There's my truck. There's the cabin. We'll see. I'm walking around. We've got a bunch of potato chips for the chipmunks. I got a whole mess of them around here. Here's a uh, back campfire pit. There's my meadow out here. I used to have a hammock hanging over there. Here's the pond. Uh, my, my dad dug this in the early 60s. There's a couple frogs in there. It's not as big as it looks. I got the zoom on. A little creek coming in of it, in it, going out over there. Nice piece of wood that everyone wants. Already been out this morning, seen a bunch of critters, and just outside here I saw a couple baby snowshoe rabbits bouncing around. Oh, yep, there's one of them right in front of the tire on the truck. Just taking a little snack. I doubt you can see them. We'll see how close I can get. See if I duck down here. Hi, little guy. He's not real scared. Sitting there right in front of the rear tire. Chewing. Yeah, this kind of stuff I love. Okay, we'll leave him alone. Uh, front steps. Go in. Let me turn the zoom down a bit. There we go. Guy is just he's not afraid of nothing there. And there he is. Get out of there. Uh, front windows, anyways. Front room. No, I don't got any lights on. No fire burning. Nice sofa out here, and kitchen table, dining room table, whatever. My bedroom over here. As you can see on this lob, I have clothes everywhere. Didn't make my bed. Nice windows. There's a couple of little deer that my dad shot. Horns, antlers. Mom's wagon. She uh, hauls little, anything that's heavy. She hauls in and out of the cabin with that. And heavy is uh, anything 20 pounds and over. These are the stairs that are terrible. This is upstairs. This is where company stays. There's a single bed right there. And a single bed. Down here. The chimney runs right up through the center of the cabin, so it stays warm up here, too. And there's a nice double bed for us adult people. And this is where I prefer to sit and read. Nice desk. Dormer window out here. You can open it up here, everything outside. Good view. Down below, all sorts of pictures there. I see if anyone knows anyone on there. Oh, Janet, you'll know this one. That's me and Isabella House.
remember what that was. Oh, there's there's one on my bed too. I enjoy it up there. Lots of memories. There's my sister. I spend a lot of time up here. Just good times. Head back downstairs. Okay. Yeah, so there's a big fireplace again. Over here. Kitchen. Kitchen is actually pretty large. It's larger than anything, I think, here. Propane stove, oven. Works out really well. I'm drying out some breadcrumbs right now. See how they're doing? Oh, they're doing alright. Back kitchen window. Okay, this is the back door. Here's my woodshed. It's not looking extremely full right now, but it's a couple years of wood. Clothesline. I do hand laundry up here if you stay long. Generator shack. Generator. Back here. This washed out years ago. Go up here. Out back of the kitchen, back side of the cabin. It's getting sunny. Very sunny. Here's uh, here's the fun campfire. The front one's okay, but this one's better. Walk up the rear. Little bridge there. My creek. Nice night for the water running by you. And over here. This is the campfire pit. Some nice fires out there. An old tiki I carved when I was you know, probably 15 or something. Carved it with a chainsaw. That's when I thought I was Hawaiian. Turns out I'm not. Some wood stacked around. You know, these are the only cedar trees you'll see this low. They grow at higher elevation, not this low. My dad planted these. But yeah, looks like it's aching for a fire tonight, I bet. And here's the real special spot. Oh, all my flowers are wilted. Just got up here last night, so I haven't had a chance to get new ones. This is uh, where my dad and my sister are buried. Miss them a lot, but uh, they're exactly where they need to be. And you can see the stacks of rocks around. They're everywhere. This is the people that knew my dad. Well, especially my dad, but my sister too. That, uh, he was a rock hound, and uh, everyone was told to bring a rock up. Some of them even had them personally engraved. Uh, yeah. I bring flowers up here every time I come up. So I'll go out later today and pick some more. Here's another tiki back here in the back of the, the grave. This one we blackened. Pretty cool one. Second or third attempt, I think, at me playing with these things. That's pretty much the tour of directly around the cabin. Keep telling you guys to come up. It's not a shack. Okay. I'm going to go inside and finish cooking breakfast and have a beer.